Look now with love upon your church Sorry. and unseal for her to follow the baptism by the power of the Spirit. Give to the water of this fire the grace of your Son. So we ask you, Father, with your, Holy, with your Son, to send the Holy Spirit upon the water of this fire. May you all who are buried with Christ in the day of baptism rise also with Him to the earth of life. And we ask as to Christ our Lord. Amen. Okay, come back here. You know, I don't know who, uh, how, how old you are, but uh, I don't know if you remember or not, but when you were like your children, little baby, unless you were baptized as an adult, your mom and dad brought you to the church, you know? I don't know if you cry or not when you, when you were baptized. And at that time, your mom and dad uh, professed the faith in Christ, in Christ for you. For you. And they try to provide spiritual environment for you to grow, and you grow older. Now you marry, you have children, and now you bring your children to the church. You, 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 are you are doing the same thing that your mom and dad did for you? The professor faith for, 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 for your children, and hopefully we try you to try to provide spiritual environment for your, for your children to grow. So today, I would like to ask all of you and all of us. Renew that baptismal promises we make at the day of our baptism by saying, I do. Do you reject Satan? In Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was born of the Virgin Mary, who was crucified, died, was buried, rose from the dead, and is now seated at the right hand of the Father. Do you believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion and the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting? And my friends, this is our faith. This is the faith of the church. And we are so proud to profess it in Christ Jesus, our Lord. Amen. All right, children, time for another day. Huh? <laughs> uh, faith of the church, which we have all professed with you. Okay. Now, who is the oldest one? Evelyn? Evelyn. All right. Can you lower the head? Take, Together, the take the head being off. Camera ready? <laughs> Camera ready. Evelyn, I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, she loves it, and of the Holy Spirit. All right, Evelyn, congratulations, guys. Uh, Get the back of her head, Phil. Yeah. She loved the water. Yes. Did she take a bath? Yes, she loves the bath time. Okay, Evelyn, uh, Audrey. Audrey. Okay, are you ready? Audrey. I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. All right, look at that, she loves it. Congratulations, guys. All right. Okay, All right. Where's your godparents? <laughs> we need you guys. Because we have to do a lot of things. <laughs> At this time, I will go to each individual baby and anoint them. That is not hitting me, don't worry. <laughs> And want them on their forehead as I am marked beside the cross on their forehead, uh, mean that they belong to God, they belong to Christ Jesus. So you follow me. Evelyn, God the Father, Lord Jesus Christ, to you for sin, given in your word by water and Holy Spirit, and welcome you with holy people. And I will anoint you with the freedom of salvation, and Christ will not this priest. Prophet and King, so many live over as a member of his body, sharing the last and last. Amen. Amen. This must be Audrey. Audrey, God the Father of Jesus Christ has freed you from sin, given you new birth by water and the Holy Spirit, and welcome you in his holy people. He now anoint you with the crystal of salvation, and Christ was not the priest, prophet, and king. So may you live always as a member of his body, sharing everlasting life. 